Terrain Minerals of Small ASX Junior. We are an exploration company, predominantly WA-centric. Probably because of COVID, we're stuck there. So we've picked some really nice projects up, which we are working. We've got a pipeline of projects. So we've got a few that are up and coming while we're working on the current ones. I think I suppose the most exciting thing, I know you're doing VMS. We've got some land just south of that called Smokebush. And there's a project there we've been drilling out. We've been getting some gallium and rare earth hits there. There's 5,000 meters due to be released in about three weeks time. And it's looking pretty encouraging using a thousand PPM cutoff. Gallium, it's been topical the last sort of six months. China controls 98% of the gallium market. They turned it off last August. Basically, if you want galliums in, gallium chips, silicon chips are out. Gallium chips are in, they're faster, less energy. Basically, missiles, bombs, radars, AI, quantum computing. There's none of that without gallium. So it's interesting. And also photovoltaics. There was a patent expired a couple of years ago and silicon chips in fault solar cells had metal in them that corrodes the German company's patent they had gallium now over half the cells coming out of China now use gallium because they last twice as long and they also produce more power so there's a big dynamic change in the gallium market and with China controlling most of it and it's probably being an industrial in the military side of things there's a security issue